A Lexington High School student is hoping to make a major impact in her community with a project to bring awareness about a life-threatening disease and the Ronald McDonald House. This hits close to home because her loved one is battling with this disease. Joining me now is Hannah Vetters. Hannah, thank you for being here. Of course. Oh, wow, this is really great. I love your shirt. We do hard things. Thank correct? you. All yeah. right, that is a great shirt. So, Hannah, where did you get your love for helping others? Where did that come from? Well, I've loved helping others since I was in elementary school. I've tried to do something little every year to mm -hmm. bring awareness to our community. And this project just, as you said, hits close to home. Mm -hmm. So you're part of an organization at Lexington High School that kind of really empowers students to really think out the box as it relates to projects. Mm -hmm. Tell us about this organization. So I'm in the SIA class at Lexington High School. We are one of the few classes around the country and our teachers are actually planning mm -hmm. the curriculum for the whole country because we wow. have some of the best teachers there are. Yeah. And um, we're under the Multiplying Good umbrella, kind of. And it's a whole yeah. organization that just focuses on helping others and doing what we can to make a difference in the community. Wow, so apart from your love array that you already had for the community, and then with this organization, you're putting together a project. It's called Bikeathon. Give us the background to what, how did you come up with the Bikeathon? Well, my cousin Jack, he's the one who's battling this disease. He has always loved riding a bike. When mm -hmm. we go to Hilton Head, we go every Thanksgiving, and he always rides the tandem. That's one of the things we've done together for as long as I can remember. And so that's one of the things he can still enjoy while he has, even while he doesn't have vision. Uh, so I thought this might be a good way for him to enjoy it and to raise awareness for it. Uh, look at that. And so um, the disease that he's battling and it's causing the, his, is causing him to lose eyesight, is that what that mm -hmm. is? Oh, wow. Um, so what do you expect from the community at this bikeathon? What are you hoping that people will do? I'm hoping that people will show up and mm -hmm. raise as much money as possible for Ronald McDonald House because not only did I want to impact Batten's disease patients, I wanted to help all children around the world who are dealing with any sort of life-threatening illness. Mm -hmm. And so I want as much support as I can to raise as much awareness as I can as well. So tell us about it. When and where, uh, where is it taking place? May, for, or May 4th, this uh -huh. Saturday, at Lexington High Methodist Church. Mm -hmm. um, there's different ages for different times. Okay. So the first event starts at 8.30. We have a tricycle race. It's for all ages. Cool. Even my grandma is riding her tricycle. Oh, cool. Okay, <laughs> Grandma. We love that. <laughs> <laughs> and the last race ends at 11. So there's mm -hmm. various times for different ages. So is there a website or a particular place where people can go? We have an Instagram page. It's called Bike for Life underscore 2024. Okay. And we have links and everything in need everything needed is linked in the bio. So what message would you send to um, you know young people your age, where it's like you're really trying to make an impact in the community, and it's not about you know me myself and I, but it's about like for instance helping your cousin, you know, bringing awareness to that. What message do you want to send to young people? That you're not too young to do something big. It's so cliche, but ev everyone can make an impact. Everyone mm -hmm. can do something to help other people. Wow, Hannah Vetters, wow, thank you so much for what you've done. It's good to know that we have some young people in the world that's definitely doing a great job here locally too as well. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Stay up to date with this story and more. Subscribe to our Watch Fox YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell to never miss an update.